I would say there are two factors that are playing in Europe. The first is moral relativism has taken such a control on the cultural and societal attitudes of Europeans that they cannot distinguish and that political correctness requires them to say that everybody's the same. Everybody's not the same. I am one of those that believes that, that the Jewish Christian uh, background is superior to that of Islam. Now, if I say that, in many liberal quarters, I'm regarded as engaging in Islamophobia or being a fanatic extremist. It's just not the case. I believe that we are entitled to determine what we consider to be a superior way of life. And I believe that our way of life is more ethical and more to the bone than that of the Islamic. The second element is Europe still has a conscience about the colonialism which it engaged in. And somehow or other, the left in Europe has focused, of all things, on the one democratic state which has emerged in the Middle East, on Israel. And today, the DNA of someone who's a real leftist is he must demonstrate his anti-Israeli his anti-Israeli feelings. And in the same way that Vietnam was a rallying cause for the left, today, to their disgrace in my opinion, uh, much of the left has allied itself with the most inhuman monsters that exist in the world and turned and made a scapegoat for all their frustrations and for all the evils that they considered that their forefathers engaged in with imperialism and so on against Israel, which is not an imperialistic state, but which they try to describe as having been born in sin and having dispossessed and completely ignoring the 2,000 years or 3,000 years of continuity of Jewish life with Israel.